Welcome back. It's time now for the business news. The government is being urged to rely more on local animators as they seek to build smart cities and transition to a digital society. Andrew Laidley tells us more. Jamaica is in the middle of a digital transformation with more people being forced to conduct some aspect of business online. As the transition continues, animation stakeholders say they can help to smoothen the process. We have different generations that exist within our island and it's just, yes, you have the younger persons who are probably more tech savvy and can adapt easily, but you do have those persons who are more reserved, um, not so fond of it and are afraid for reasons, you know, valid reasons. And I think in our way, in, in terms of commercializing, what we've been doing, for example, is doing little how-to videos. So how do you, for example, use an app? In addition to the animation jobs which will be created, the stakeholders argue that more people will be able to relate to animation. In a, in a smart city environment where you have all these touch points um, for, for, for various things, you know, the, the, the most and one of the easiest ways to, to communicate something is, is, is definitely through, um, through, through animation. Um, you know, so I think you know, as, as, as we start going down the roads of, of smart cities, you know, digital experiences and, 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 so, and, and so on, I mean, that, you know, that, 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 you know, that, that benefits the, you know, the, the, the industry. But it won't come cheap. It requires a lot of investment for the smart city that I think people are thinking of is everything, lights everywhere, touch, you know, they're thinking big and it, it requires a lot of capital investment. Andrew Laidley, TVJ News. We go down to currency trading. The day ended with the greenback selling for a record $154.66. The Canadian dollar closed at $125.89. The pound sterling is going for $215.96, while the euro ended the day at $189.39. The JSE index gained 804 points today, and the junior market index is up 23 points. Among today's winners were Cygnus Credit Investment US dollar shares, Lasco Manufacturing, JMMB Group 7.5%, Express Catering, and Fosridge. On the losing side, Iron Rock Insurance, SSL Venture Capital, JMMB Group 7.25%, Sibony Group, and Main Event Entertainment Group. And that's it for the Business Day. I'm Herman Green. News from overseas after the break. <laughs>